Hey guys, welcome to the last domain of the Tableau Certified Associate Consultant exam prep. This domain is going to test your understanding of server permissions, so you need to know the basics with respect to how permissions affect publishing abilities, as well as how to provide content access to various groups or users. This domain accounts for 8% of the overall exam content, so you may only see three to four questions max related to this specific material. So I won't spend too much time on domain five, just make sure you review server permissions, especially if you're someone who is unfamiliar with these topics. All right, let's jump into our sample questions. For question number one, we need to specify which function can be used to check if a specific user is a member of the technology management group in Tableau Server. And the answer here is C. So we're going to use is member of function, which allows you to see if the current user is a member of a given group on the server. All right, so moving on to question number two. Let's say you wanted to create a dashboard which shows you a list of Stanford students and their mentors. However, the Stanford leadership team should have full visibility, whereas each mentor should only see their respective students. Which calculated field will you use? And the answer here is D. So you're going to create this calculated field using the username function. You're going to place it into filters and this filter is going to check whether the current user is a member of Stanford leadership team or a mentor. For question number three, you need to create a calculated field that checks if the name of the logged in user appears in the list of usernames. A and C are correct. Make sure you guys also review string functions because you may see a number of string functions in this specific domain as well. In question number four, we need to identify which set of rules is true for a logged project. All of these options are true except for B. Permissions can be different across content in the project. This is only true for customizable projects, not for locked projects. All right, so that's it for domain five review. Make sure you check out additional resources in the description section of this video. I wish you all best of luck on the final exam. Please let me know how you do and just to let you guys know, I will be including some bonus questions related to performance, probably closer towards the end of this week. So thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for more tablet content.